Hello, and welcome to Random Play! Plague Inc! Yes, this is Plague Inc, a game that I've been wanting for some time, sent in by... Flareneth! That's, that's a flare and a nith at the end of it. You see the flare? It's okay. We got it. All right. Flare nith. All right. Flare nith sent me this game. So I went over Steam. I am now playing it currently. Thank you very much. And uh, this is a game. I'm not sure if it's directly related to a Flash game I played a long time ago. I remember a long time ago there was a Flash game uh, in browser that was similar to this. And it had at least the very, at the very least, had the same objective. Uh, and I'm not sure if that's coincidence or if this is the evolved form of it. And, uh, basically, the objective of this game, from what I've been told, is, um, you are a virus, and your job is to infect and uh, basically kill the world. I like this concept. So, I mean, it makes sense for me to be the virus, right? I guys change the pace. I'm the guy that was in Dead Rising off the record and all the zombies in the world, and now I'm the virus infecting all the people. Maybe if I can even consider this part of my official storyline, you never know. But anyway, first I'm gonna play this. I just booted up this game five seconds ago. There is no tutorial I checked. Not available in the currently early access build, so I don't know how evolved uh, this game is so far, and there's Naked Men on Adult Swim right now. Why do I have that on in the background? I don't know. I'm turning that off. Okay, then. I should also turn off my AC. This, this video is full of, uh, the utmost professionalism. All right, so, all right, main game. We have different modes here. We have main game, um, speed run, compete with friends to see who can wipe out humanity the fastest. Okay. Official scenarios. So I'm guessing this kind of works like um, Civ 5 or Civ 4. Well, okay, any Civ game where it's like, hey, here's the main game, but if you want, here's a unique set of objectives for you to do. You can also do custom with that. Okay, that's none of them. All right, I'm going to play main game. I'm going to see how this works. This is the precursor. Everyone, this is the precursor to Project Zomboid. I introduce you the prequel of, uh, all right. All right, so this looks very similar. All right, so I start out with bacteria, most common cause of plague, unlimited potential. I seems like I have to unlock the others. Virus, win the game with bacteria. All right, all right, so it looks like in order to win the next tier of virus or of infection type, I have to win the game once with the previous one. I'm guessing this shouldn't take too long. Let's see, we have virus, fungus, neurox worm. Oh, that sounds lovely. Parasites, necrovirus, I'm prion, nanovirus. Now that just sounds great. Bioweapon! Oh, I want the bioweapon! Can I? I want bioweapon! Come on! Ah! Oh, okay, fine. I'll be a bacteria then. Continue! Uh, oh! Oh, in modified genetic code. Alright, so this might be a little bit like Spore, except it kills people. Oh, wait. Oh. 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 I don't have anything. Never mind. I don't- I don't have- I don't have- get- I don't have any of the genes. I- I can't- I can't get my genes! Where's my- I don't have the Levi's yet, okay? Fine! Continue. Alright. Casual for new players wanting a quick game, normal for experienced genetic strategist. No, I'm not. I'm not a genetic strategist, so I'm gonna go casual. I don't care if it's friggin', I don't know, easy mode! Oh, there's cheats now. Immune strain, hidden strain, unlimited strain, turbo strain, shuffle strain, lucky dip strain, and unknown. Coming in a future mutation. Alright. Alrighty then, I think, let's go, casual. Do I get to name the virus? I want to name the virus. Wow, did the game just freeze on me? Hello? Oh, oh, I named, I named the plague! Alright, maximum of 20 characters. Hmm, 20 characters? Really? 20? That's a, that's a lot of characters. I kind of like that idea. Um, <laughs> the uh, 
choices. I could name it Pax. I could name it Zombie Cancer. That would seem to be the typical response, yeah? But it's not really a cancer, is it? It's a bacteria. Hmm. You know what? They gave me 20 characters, and um, I'm going to abuse that. Z. <laughs> no, what? No, that's too simple. Um, my virus strain is virus Om Omega or Omegia. Say that five times fast. All right. You are a new bacteria. To win, you must evolve and spread across the world, wiping out all humans in the ultimate plague. All right, that sounds fun. Select a country to begin your plague. When you click on it, you may see more information. Pop the start bubble. All right, so I guess the tutorial is here. I hope this isn't too long and too slow. All right. World population, blah, blah, blah. All right, I'm gonna... Let's start somewhere in central USA. Or... Is there anywhere? No, that seems fine to me. Or Japan. I could... I could uh, infect Japan. No, I want them to be last. I want some of my animes to be finished. All right, all right, let's go Central USA. Because, you know, why not? It's rare that an actual bacteria originates from the USA. Except swine flu, which was arguably Mexico's fault. Uh, yeah, sure, USA. I'm here. Oh, Mijia's justification is near three turns of fifteen begins in USA. Omega Sister Fetish of Russian M15 has infected its first human. We can unspecialize it most of all using DNA points to infect more people. Alright. How do I do that? I don't have any dead yet. Um <laughs> begins in USA. How do I do this? Where's where do I where do I do things? How do I increase my DNA? Wow, there it is. Okay, there's the button. Evolution history. Ooh, I really like the music in this game, I gotta say. Um, what can I do? Transmit? Oh, 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 I see. I see. All right, so this will help transmission. I'm guessing this help gets from thing to thing. Symptoms. This is... Nausea, that's pretty simple. Insomnia, inability to sleep makes people irritable and less productive. Uh, chance of infection by spreading pathogens surrounding, blah, blah, blah. Abilities, cold resistance, ooh. Heat resistance, so, they, oh yeah, so this is pretty much exactly the Flash game I played, but a fancier version of it. So, probably the same thing. All right, I like that. I, I played that for a little while. Let's see. Um, I want to start out with something simple. Something that people might not pick up on quite a bit. If you're nauseated a lot, you know something's wrong. However, if you're you got some insomnia going, you might just think you're being having some sleepless nights for a few days until it persists. So, I can't do that, though. Okay, I realized I only have one DNA point. All right. And that costs 12. Well, shit, I can't do anything. Never mind. All right, then how do I get more DNA points? Is there anything that's one point? I only have one DNA. Um, all right. Close for now. Uh, what do I do? What do I do? What, what old, old character is a key? All right. Oh, all right. DNA when they randomly appear to get bit. Okay. Oh, all right. Now I have two. Okay. Oh, three. Now I have three. If I want three, insomnia, please. <laughs> they will never get sleep. Of course, half of America doesn't get sleep anyway. Oh, hey, achievement unlock of all of your disease. Yay! I'm an MLG pro. You successfully evolved Omega. You have spent DNA points to evolve your disease, and more options have opened up. Get more points by popping DNA in biohazard bubbles and infecting people. All right, I have infected three people so far. Where am I? Like where? Oh, 
Think, what would happen in real life? Plague Inc. is a hyper-realistic model of the world. Plan your strategy and evolve your disease accordingly by spending DNA points. Yeah, 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 yeah. Where, like... Alright, so are these the infection areas? Like, how did I already spread to different parts of the U.S.? Uh... I imagine most of my infection is only in the U.S. thus far. Alright, seven people are infected, no one's dead yet. Typewriting monkeys produce copy of Shakespeare. That's... <laughs> okay. Alright, I'm fine with that. 